Hello. In a number of videos, we made different turbines. From this small turbine that you can see working. And a medium turbine. And the last one is a big turbine. Now in this video we want to measure their speed and power experimentally. And finally compare them. We start the experiment. We start the experiment with this small turbine. The speed of this turbine is high. To determine the power of rotation, I use a locking pliers and place it on the axis of rotation. And we also measure the rotation speed with a tachometer. Because it is winter and the weather is cold, all the steam coming out of the turbine can be seen. Its speed is 7,482 RPM, which is low for this turbine. Probably, the turbine has a special problem and if it was healthy, its rotation speed would be higher than 20,000 RPM. Now I will place the locking pliers on the axle. Will the turbine be able to turn it? The turbine is weak in initial rotation power and also has high energy loss. We continue the test on the medium turbine. It is the turn of this turbine and the label you see on the reel is for the tachometer laser reflection.
The rotation speed is 13,221 RPM. Now it's time to experiment with locking pliers. So this turbine cannot rotate the weight of the locking pliers. This turbine is bigger and its rotor radius is bigger. Its rotation speed is lower and is 3,385 RPM. Because it has a lot of torque, it takes a long time to come to a complete stop. I stop it with this belt. Now we do the experiment with locking pliers. It can spin easily and it will be dangerous if the speed of rotation is increased. So it has good initial rotation power. In order to convert the speed of the turbines into more power, we can use a bigger pulley. By doing this, the speed decreases but the power increases. The larger the radius of the pulley, the greater the rotation power of its axis. You saw that this little turbine made a lot of noise, and so did this one.
But the bigger turbine has less noise and better power. I hope this experience was useful for you. Bye until the next program.